All right, this is what I wanted to watch, though, bro. This Davis made a video called Curing a Rest, where he linked up with an actual lady, bro. Like a real life, a real life lady, bro. If y'all saw a person, too, like, why the f are you trying to cure this, bro? The f beat they ass and leave. The f are you trying to cure them for? The hell? Bettering society? Y'all think someone that's racist? I've seen so many people, like, over the last few months go to, like, the most racist. Yo, I know where this is. This is Piedmont Park, bro. In America. I'm not gonna, I wanted to do that, not just to, like, go there and troll, but I genuinely have always had the thought, like, is it possible to, to change somebody's, like, mindset? Is, is it possible to make someone who's racist not racist? I told you, I did not have to go to the most racist. So you gonna try to convert a racist to not hate black people and you walking around with Yeezy slides with your crusty toes hanging out? Really, Davis? This is town in America. I stayed right here in Atlanta, Georgia. And I found someone who is a self-proclaimed racist. Depending on who you ask, some people will tell you that it's stronger than it's ever been. Some people will be delusional and tell you it doesn't exist at all. And then some people will tell you the honest truth. Do you feel like racism still exists in 2023? Yeah, definitely. Have you had like any personal experiences like as of recently? Recently, I got caught in the hard order in the Zaxby's any... drive through on God. I'm not even lying. On God. Recently, I've, I've definitely had some, though. I mean, even in the military, I used to be in the Army. Yes, yes, I do. I just moved here not too long ago, and there's definitely a big difference between the North and the South. And down Dude, here Dude, no, Atlanta not racist space. of that bad. Like, well, anything in particular? Particular job opportunities, uh, just hateful looks and just they gassing. outright rudeness. It does. Why do, you say, why do you say that? This nigga white talking about it does. Nigga, your team is the problem, bro. Do a team meeting, nigga. Sort out the issues. The fuck? Because I see. You personally experience it? Yes. Like, any any specific situations? Uh, so, uh, the college that I was studying in, uh, of course. Oh, he's um, Indian. Oh, I'm a dickhead. He's Indian. Oh, I'm a dickhead. The situations? Uh, so, uh, the college that I was studying in, uh, of course, uh, on uh, at a very bigger level. You see the. You see the yeah. Chad, y'all got racism before? You find that uh, the diversity that this country has, it's not being reflected in terms of the structure that we have. Just like when you go into like the little office and shit like that, you know, they'll go look out for the white people or they'll look out for the other shit that they know, you know what I'm saying? So yeah. You deal with bullshit all the time. I don't let it phase me though. I mean, we in the South. So. If you was a media yeah. racist, like. Welcome to America. Oh, yeah. I told y'all about that, right? The old white nigga in the drive-thru when I was working at Zaxby's, bro. Nigga gave me a $10 bill and said, welcome to America. The fuck, nigga? Do I look like I came on a fucking boat? The fuck you mean? Well, like, bro, that shit pissed me the fuck off, bro. That's so it's racist. Straight up. You got one question. Shit, what happened to you? Like, why, what why, you, why you hate people? Why you hate us so much? I know you took that 10 No, it wasn't even a 10 I'm gassing it. It was a $1 million bill. And we flip it over and start talking about you need to follow your Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. This bill was just to catch your attention. Blah, blah, blah on the back of it, bro. Nigga's a bitch. Fuck that nigga, bro. I thought I was getting real money too. Cap? One million dollar Jesus money. Nigga think I'm capping, right? Think I'm capping, right? Niggas give these out, bro. Trying to like convert niggas to... to trying to convert niggas to... To, to their religion, bro. Niggas dead ass be handing these out. Will you go to heaven when you die? Nigga, I don't give a fuck. Give me a tip, bitch ass nigga. Handing out fucking Jesus money. Should be pissing niggas off. And that's the honest question. Where does this hate stem from? So today... Yeah, imagine Davis being, being, being your racist, history teacher. Non-racist. As you can see, I have security for this video because I didn't know if it was going to go left. Let's see what we can do. All right, pleasure me. You said you're not from Atlanta? So you're you're deep from the countryside. Oh no! Countryside. Does she look Georgia, racist? Right? So you what 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 do you say you classify as? You classify yourself as a a white supremacist. A white supremacist. So why why? Oh man. Oh man. Why why do you say that you're a white supremacist? I wouldn't say I'm one. I just believe in them. So I why? Believe the fuck that mean, bitch? The fuck? I believe that they run the world. So you and believe that they have all the power. The fuck that means? We're all slaves to them. Okay. And slaves. So like, 
Yeah. You wouldn't technically be a slave. It'd be like just me. No, I think I think all people. Are. All people are slaves to them. The okay. Fuck? So do you like believe in like equality? Like do you believe in like racial equality or? I I mean, yes. So, yes. Isn't that the Gucci flip flop girl? Bad baby, dude. Bad baby is fine as fuck now, bro. I don't even care what niggas gotta say. On God, I will fuck bad baby. It's not like it's in some ways, but not in other ways. I mean, if you believe in equality, I don't believe in equality. Tell me, tell me what, what the you're fuck? About I don't believe any of us are equal. Move, bitch. Even equality, I don't believe in equality. Tell me, tell me what you mean by that. I don't believe any of us are equal. Okay. I believe we're all in the system. Okay, so like, but I'm. You're blocked. On God, you're blocked. On God, you're blocked. You're blocked. You're blocked. You're blocked. You're blocked. They're just cheap and. Um. I feel like I should take the time to put out the obvious disclaimer that what she's about to say and continue saying throughout the rest of the video is not true at all. I don't agree with it. Davis, let her say her piece, man. Why you cutting her off, bro? Say this after, bro. Let her say her piece, bro. And I honestly don't condone any of this type of stuff. The only reason I'm letting her talk fully through is because I'm trying to hear what she's saying and then tell her afterwards later on in the video what she's saying is wrong and how she needs to change it. Hands are really bad. I mean, they're not, I used to work for them. So I was in property management for five years. There's individual instances of like, I feel like you can find individual instances of That's like anybody fucked being up, an bro. asshole. Like, I can white black hey i like anybody. indians oh god i do she wallet white nationalists, nationalists yes yeah. so what is um that means like you believe in like keeping the white race pure right because that's that's what a white nationalist is where they don't want to mix races yeah is yes, that you... the, uh, my family does believe that but you don't believe that no. there's would... white people that don't want to fuck no like other race like they just want to keep it in the in the race bro like they just want to keep it in damn bro I would say I was raised in it. Like it took me a long time to. Un un How could you turn down a? Things. But yes, I used that to be booty Latina races. bitch. Like I used to wear rebel flags. I used to wear all Dixie Outfitter clothes. My, I mean, from the time I was born, my dad basically told me that if I was to ever date a black man or be with one, like he would hang me on a tree. What the fuck? Damn, nigga. Holy shit. With the black man, he said that he would kill me. <laughs> Yo! A lot of, like, a lot of with him? things were told to me. I was even told it was in the Bible that I couldn't even be with a black man. Like, what the because fuck? it's against God. So, how much of that do you still believe today, though? It took a long time. Like, it took days. Yeah, she got the Gucci belt on, though. 26 damn. years old to know that this was all just indoctrination. God damn. Yo! I am Ewan. Thank you for the sub, bro. So you wouldn't even really consider yourself a racist today. But you say you're racist, but you say you wouldn't even consider yourself. I have racist tendencies because of those things. Like, I I guess you would say profile people, even though I'm not intentionally doing it. It's just, it just is in my blood. So what do you think about me? Like, just off, like, off of the few oh, seconds you know me. Or, or hour I would, you know me. Um, Davis, I would say that you look like, um, you know what I'm saying? You like sports. Um, maybe mainly basketball or football um you know what i'm saying you you may uh frequently uh like to steal or do things like that i don't know just something about your attitude is telling me that i don't know man i don't know I would say you're just a gentleman a nice man oh or just wanting to she said he looked like a nice man though to the world so when you see a mixed race like a mixed race couple like this right here like what do you think they're mixed race. I thought they were both white. Yeah, he's clearly like Hispanic. Oh, okay. Um. Whatever. Wait, so you, don't, you don't bother you. It is so like racist niggas when they see like a white girl with a nigga, they just be like, oh, I fucking oh, like they just be mad. Like, oh my gosh, she's with a nigga. Oh, I want to say the hard R. I can't though. I can't though. Like really? Like it bothers gang, them gang, that bad? Gang, gang, it's fucking gang, crazy. Gang, yeah. Gang, gang, back in the store. She bothers you. What so, you watching? I mean, if it's like something that's to uh, do with somebody's curing a racist or their mental health or anything like that, then of course. This nigga but, Davis is actually a bomb. I mean, I was ra like I was raised to to believe like to hate y'all for for no reason. Are any like, of y'all parents racist? Like, why? Why are you supposed to hate why, black people? Why am I supposed to hate these people? Why? Okay. 
Why are they bad for me? Why you know what? You know I know it's important. You know what? What's a, a big step in that is is conquering damn, your fears. Just a lot of you niggas saying yes. God damn. Yo, why is so many niggas saying yes, bro? The fuck, dude? Why are so many of y'all fucking saying yes? What the fuck? God damn, bro. Down and talking to black people sometimes. Would you ever do that? Is that, is that, is that too scary? Like if you saw if you saw like a black couple right here, like, would the you? Hood? No. If, if you if you cool. saw like if you saw like a couple, like, like would you I ever sit down? Hood, no. and, like would you just ever say hi? My name is M Melanie. I wouldn't. Bitch name Melanie. Myself, That's how you know like, she. Would you, would you be able to do that if you saw them right there? Just any couple right there? Probably not. Not because of their race. Just because of I wouldn't just go up to people. Okay. So yeah, I know you say you're from a the country. There's probably no black people in the city, right? Oh, there's a ton. There's a ton. How does it make That's you feel? That's why like? I don't go to the hood. No, I don't go to that side of town. So like when you see like a black person on. Nigga, what's the hood? I never even understood that, chat. There's no hoods that's just straight black niggas. It be a mix. On God, it be a mix. There's no hoods that's just straight black niggas. On a day-to-day -day basis, like, what are you doing? I mean, well, before, my dad, my dad would just say comments like, oh, they don't fucking work, or they are, they're living on welfare, or... Damn. And, like, just looking at them. Just mm -hmm. no, not knowing anything about this person, yeah. like, you think where about they him? came from. <laughs> like, you, you, you can't tell me that's not a good guy. He's just sitting here walking his dog Yo, in the park. He's dog. just chilling. He's a, oh, that's a good nah, guy right bro. there. Right? Yeah. Child, look at the way she fidgeting with her hands, bro. She really like holding off from just calling this nigga Davis the hard R, bro. So you never had a black boyfriend? Like even to this day? Uh, I have dated one black <laughs> And my dad went crazy. Like it was a bad. Like, like how crazy? Like I'm gonna kill that. And no, he actually, I mean, he's actually transformed my dad's brain, but he's still, he's still a racist. Those so you feel like the, there's different types the of black people. Oh, uh, yeah, I do. Mm -hmm. I do. I definitely do. So like me and him, is me, me and him different? From the hood, yeah. Because you just don't like poor people. Poor people? The fuck? The fuck that mean? Yeah. I wouldn't consider him poor. I mean, there's now hiring signs everywhere. So you, what, what, do you, what do you consider them? Lazy, uh, not, not motivated, so uh, if it no was a, ambition. I, I was preparing. Shit, I'm not gonna lie though. She racist as hell, but she got me to a T, nigga. I'm not gonna lie, bro. I almost didn't spark up stream today because I was too cozy in my bed, bro. <laughs> I'm not even trolling. She lucky spin. For the worst, honestly. I was preparing for the worst because what what person is willing to say that in 2023 is not. I never know. I've never met somebody. But I'm, I'm saying I don't want to be, but I know it's inside of me. Like I was raised in that. Like it's. I know it's there. I don't okay. want it to be. I want to get it out. She claims she wants these racist thoughts out of her brain, and there's nothing she can do. Yo, am I tweaking? No disrespect. Davis just has an interesting build, chat. Is that fucked up to say? Am I tweaking? His build just, just mad peculiar, bro. I don't know, man. So we're gonna put on a lie detector so she can actually learn the truth about herself. A lie and detector. See if we can have any no. impact on her brain. If I ever get hooked up to a lie detector, it's over for me, herself. bro. Let's see what we can do. <clears throat> okay, Melanie. Um, the first question I want to ask is: Are you currently racist? No. Oh shit. I told you it's inside of me. <laughs> Bitch said it's inside of me. What does that mean, bro? The fuck you mean I told you it's inside of me? That makes no fucking sense, bro. That literally makes no sense, bro. I'm just trying to release it. Okay, okay. Um, Thank you for the sub, Could you ever see yourself being friends with a black person? I have black friends, yes. That's true. She has black friends! Okay. Do you like mixed couples? Yes. That's true. Let's okay. go, bro. She getting saved already. Do you like Indian people? No. That's true. So how do you allow the right? Yo, that's so fucked. Hey, man, shout out my Indians, bro. Part. If I have black friends and I'm not, a, how does that work? I See, this bitch that. is low key sped, though. She said, So, how am I racist if I have black friends? Are you fucking dumb? Yo, did y'all notice, though, chat? Not on some fucked up shit. The niggas that's, the niggas that's racist 
that have black friends, the black friends that they have are the ones that make them look dumb to make the white niggas laugh. Y'all have all met niggas like that, that make themselves look like dickheads to make like niggas laugh. Like they be like making jokes about like, oh, my dad left. <laughs> like those niggas be so corny, bro. Y'all know what I'm talking about, bro. That's yeah, raccoons, sense. raccoons. I don't uh, get to determine how you pass or fail purely based on the data. So uh, what does it go? What does it go based off of? Like to tell if they're, they're telling the truth or not? Yeah, so based off I um, you're connected to those different senses, and when you're telling a lie, there's actually a physical response that happens in your body. Um, that middle one with the green one is actually measuring the blood that rushes. All right, shut up! I don't need no scientific explanation. Sense. Ask her if she'll hang. Dreads. You like a marine, or you've had that kind of extensive training. Right. Do you like people with dreads? No. Oh shit, man. Damn, Damn. nigga. That's true. Why? Get the camera real quick. <laughs> Look at this so, nigga. Look at this bitch ass nigga, Manny, bro. Yo, man, I've been on stream you, since buddy. you started. Is that Loki Dick Nah, Manson? that just mean you a real ass nigga. If you saw him on the street, would you think he's a thug? That's what? not Tekka, bro. That's Manny. What? Why? Okay, show me. What? No, but what? Bro, what it? Yo, that nigga's low key sped. My bad. The fuck? Close my door. Close my door. That's because of my huh? father. Close the door. Okay, Alright, close my door, bro. That's true. Damn. So there's nothing. So Yo, there's, and there's, hey, there's, all of you niggas that said, oh my gosh, she doesn't like you, you racist ass niggas know that twists and dreads are not the same thing, right? You dumbass niggas. So this, this this is not even like a for the light detector, but so just anytime you see anyone with like dreads or anything, you just would assume like he like he's a thug. He like probably sells drugs or he probably Okay, so like, what, what the about fuck? the fuck? Oh, people that just like have that hairstyle because it's a part of their heritage, but they're not huh? into anything like like that. How does selling drugs got to do with having know. drugs? In my experience, most of them sold drugs or was in gangs or like it's not been good. Okay. Most black men that want to get away from that n n normally cut their hair or change their style or different. Damn, if I want to be professional and change my life, do I have to go bald? Damn. Is that what I have to do? Try to be different. I, I've, I've had that, that type of hairstyle before, and it's just because, like, I like it. Nigga, like, my... Davis, you ain't never had no dreads in your fucking life. What the fuck is this nigga talking about, bro? Nigga, you ain't never had no fucking dreads in your fucking life. There's no way... Bro, this is not dreads, bro. These are twists. There's a difference, bro. These are twists. There's a difference. What the fuck? What the fuck, nigga? Okay. The fuck, nigga? My whole life I've been... But that's profiling. I don't even know this person. Then I'm just like, nope, I ain't fucking with them. Okay, so I, I got a great question for you right now. If you saw a black man enter the elevator, are you clenching your purse? Nigga, shit, I'm Depending clenching something. Who, what he represents. Him? The fuck? Him? No. I would just think that he's just chilling. Thank you for the sub, a leader. Oh. Oh, yeah. They got they got the hair the same hairstyle though, low key. Well, I guess the volume did it. I guess Hell. I didn't. I like I wouldn't pay attention to the details. Like it's gotta be like that, like in like, your face. In your face, like yeah. too black. Fuck no. Nah, that's crazy. <laughs> so you Chad, am I a black tripping boyfriend? though? Not on no fucking. Is he better shit. than all your other boyfriends? She look more ghetto than the black nigga she probably races to. She look ghetto as shit, nigga. Like, I'm just keeping it a B. <laughs> Oh, to this day, you're dating a. She's dating a black person. Black man to this day. Yeah, sort of, kind of, whatever we are. Yeah. Um, you said you have, you have a black boyfriend. Do you guys do race play? What the fuck is that? 
Like, he fucking slaved you, like... Hell no. Hell no. I thought motherfucker ever tried me like that. I know, but you never, like, called him a slave on some, like, shit like do that, that? Some, like, kinky shit, like... Hell no. Okay. So, no, y'all got mutual that? respect for each other. I mean, I got respect for him. I don't think it's the other way around. Why do you think he doesn't respect you? Other reasons? <laughs> I don't want to kill him. I don't want to say this video. Once you go black, you never go back? That big ass dick, huh? Melanie. That BBC really changed. My bad. I'll never be with a white man again. Damn. So you like racist. Is that, is that true? <laughs> That's kind of crazy, low key. She's racist, but like. But I'm not trying to be. Yeah, trying to be. So. Wow. So you racist, uh, but you like. So she only like his meat. Like she don't like him as a person. Is that what like she trying to say? She only like Brody Dick. Prayed for you decades, years to take the hate on chart. Yeah, I mean, I don't hate black people. That's not. I just my dad just conformed me to think, oh, they're gonna, they're gonna, they're gonna scam you. They're gonna rob you. You're gonna get shot. Well, I don't hate you, but if yeah. you have any bias towards anybody specifically based on race, that would make you technically the only person that has hate hatefulness. Holy shit! I'm not really. Hating That's what my people. grandma said, have... nigga. What? Oh, hell no. I'm going to be real. I'm not going to say who, but a member of my older family, like on the grandparent level, did say Asian niggas can't drive. I was not fucking with it, though. Like, I was like, yo, don't say that. That's fucked up, bro. That's fucked, bro. You can't say that. I know that they're evil and they want they want us to suffer. They, I mean, they're poisonous in the food. They're poisonous in the water we drink. The shampoo you use, the soap you use every day, the detergent you use, all of it's poison. But nobody does research. Nobody cares about these stuff. Nobody talks about it. It's On God, she watches YouTube shorts. Low key, don't do it, bro. This how I'm gonna end up. I I gotta stop too, bro. She watches YouTube shorts. This the type of shit they be telling you on there, bro. This the type of shit you be seeing on there, bro. Don't get talked about on Joe Rogan. He's the only person that talks. That about ass, him. bro. If I just, okay, because I, I know you're saying you're trying to you're trying to like fix this thing you have going on. If I if I if I was able to to call an Indian person, would you be able to have a civilized like conversation with them? What type of conversation? Just hello. Hello, how are you? How's your day going? Oh no, I'm just up here doing this video. I might be in my feelings about it. <laughs> she can't even talk to an Indian nigga, bro. Come on, dude. It's not that deep, bro. Come on, man. On God, bro. You can't have a single conversation with an Indian brother. Would you Would you be willing to try? Would you be willing to try? I would try. I mean, I don't know if I would succeed, but That's I could try. Fucked. We put her on a call? No. Nice to meet you. Have you uh, despised me? Yeah, they're cheap, and they overcharge in their gas stations, and they're not nice to Americans. Most people that own gas stations aren't even Indian. Well, I, I used to work for Indians at in property management and they were horrible to their tenants. Oh. Like, extremely. Like, yo, bitch, you got a whole muffin top. Your build looks like a cupcake. She literally looks like a cupcake. Like, actually. Bad. Yeah, but you're judging, you're judging the actions of a few to the character of many. Yeah, I was just dis discussing that, how I put them all in one category instead of just the what individual. The fuck? Okay. Alright. So, do you think I'm a bad Indian? I don't know you. Damn. Oh. A nigga like me. <laughs> but by looking at you, I you look like no. a pretty decent guy. I look, I look like a decent guy. I don't look like a criminal. A thug. I wouldn't even say that you were Indian. You look black to me. The hair? My hair, yeah. My hair is the color black. No, it looks like yeah, nah, this bitch their hair. special. It looks bro. like nigga hair. acting like he ain't do this a few months ago. Y'all cooked me up to a lie detector and asked me if I'm racist. On God, the lie detector saying no, bro. Dead ass. I'm not even trolling. Bear. 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 Did I lie? I think um, I think um, I think that's like an important step right there because stuff like that can allow you to, to step outside your comfort zone. I know doing this is probably outside your comfort zone. I think it's outside. Nigga said, do it. How much does it zone, cost? Rent a lie detector person. How much that shit cost?
Nigga, is this website a scam? <laughs> Yo, this website gotta be a scam, right? There's no way this is a real website. Like, there's actually just no way. There's genuinely no way this is actually a real website. They got fucking Bryce Hall and fucking TikTok niggas on this shit. Yeah, nah, this gotta be fake, bro. How I actually get one, bro? That's the real website? Fuck up, bro. Hold on. Uh, rent, uh... Paul, oh, that's the AMP nigga. Dude, that guy is fake. That's probably why Davis didn't use him because niggas would have called him out, bro. The lie detector dude, chat, it's been proven like 50 times that this guy is a liar. You just pay him and he tells you like he tells, he says whatever you tell him to say, bro.